Enduring people don't hear when I say cutting. Apparently, we can't take Silk Road like we planned. So I guess they're the only passengers who could afford the tickets. I talk to you. Uh, da -na 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 Yar! We can leave as soon as we get our orders. I know, but I have the stream open, and I heard at least the part when I said cut. Everyone rolls in time with this drum. I hear there's an aisle in the middle of the caravan, but I've never seen it. From the sea, it looks like Silk Road is totally flooded. I can't... I can't wait until we get to Tolby and I can stretch my wings. Hmm, I wonder when we're going to launch. Once we cast off, you just leave the rest to us. You can only work hard one, like this while you're young. We're the ones who make the ship move. Rowing is a man's job. And before I make the women do it, and the old people, of course. Fuck yeah, lucky metal. Before another cutscene. Kimi Fei, this is adventure time. How are you? Now what? You want to see the captain too? Trying to launch the ship? We can't sit still in this dangerous sea. Enduring really, really pansy sailors. What was that? We don't care about that. We paid our money and now you have to launch the ship. But the captain just decided to set sail just a second ago. So we're taking off? Yes, preparations are being made right now. Well, maybe we were a bit rash running up here like that. Please, launch the ship when you're ready. Dot dot dot. Dangerous sea. That's what you said, isn't it? It's dangerous out there. Is that why you wouldn't launch the ship? Yeah, I did. The sea is dangerous now. There are monsters. Monsters, you say? Lately, we've been sighting creatures never before seen in Karagal. Dangerous ones? Actually, some even came aboard the ship and attacked the crew. That is dangerous! We suspect that our sh replacement ship may have been attacked. With such dangerous creatures around, you might need warriors. It is certainly dangerous, but the ship is okay. After all, we... I'll be glad- if there are monsters, I'll be glad to help out. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Hey, Oronos, I thought we have to make it to Colasso. If we're late, we can't enter. That's true, but... Hey, maybe you can give us a hand too, Sean. Hey, look, it's Sean. Sean, he's on the boat. Apparently, Sean has blue hair. Haha. <laughs> Are you really going to help out? I'm a man of my word. If I said I'll help, I'll help. With you guys helping me to keep the de deck shape, the ship should be okay. 
So, can we set off now? No. Now we need someone to protect the oarsmen. Protect the oarsmen, huh? You guys need some warriors. You have an idea? I saw some warriors amongst the passengers below decks. You think they'd help us out? And during talking, if they're from Mangar, they will. Hmm. If we could... If they could help out, we'd be unbeatable. And of course, we still have my lucky anchor. Or not. Oh shit! It's gone! It's vanished! What? The captain's beloved anchor! The anchor. Our good luck charm? Oh, that? What's the big deal? So what if the old trinket's gone? What do you mean, oh, that? That anchor's been keeping my ship safe for years. It's just decorative, right? Even if we find some warriors, we won't make it without that anchor. We're not leaving. But you just said we were leaving. That was when I thought we still had the anchor. All this fuss over a little trinket. Little trinket? Weren't you listening to what he just said? It's not just a decoration. It's a good luck charm. The ship doesn't leave until we find it. What's the problem? We've got some warriors to help us. Maybe we shouldn't have taken it. Hey! Hey, you! What are you doing here? You heard the captain. The ship goes nowhere. You know, if they were real sailors, they wouldn't let women on the ship. Because that's apparently bad luck. Somebody stop them. They can't be planning a mutiny. I wonder if those two are planning on taking over the ship. Those warriors got tired of waiting, so they went up to see the captain. Oh wait, they're talking about Arnos and Chan. Who cares about them? Before it's magically down here. Or not. Uh, go up the ladder. Oh wait, I think I have to go mind read people. I waited too long. I'll get into trouble if I don't come clean. I had to help confess that I hid it on top of the mask. There it is. I knew it was up there. I fucking knew it! Fuck yeah! Damn it. Radio's back. I got you, Anchor Cham. Oh, of all the bad luck, losing my lucky charm, the ship can't leave until we find it. You mean this lucky charm? Hey, it's my lucky anchor! <laughs> Shut up, Mega. Well, look at that! Did you find our charm for us? Was it atop the mast? It was atop the mast? Why right there, of all places? I don't know how to say. I don't know what to say. Thank you. Now we can set sail. Enduring talking! Boy, that was a relief. Now we can set sail, right, Captain? Let's go! Mm, not just yet. Not yet. What's the problem this time? The cargo see is thick with monsters. But you don't. Nope. 
Um, longest cutscene. I don't know. The first, the thing in the Elemental Stars place is pretty goddamn long. Well, it's just like Sun said. The best place we can do is the best we can do is protect the tank. We need someone to protect the oars. Son, you look like you have someone in mind to help us. Yeah. Someone to help? Who? Those warriors, that's who. Alright. Cutting. <laughs>